out here amongst the floating logs in Spirit Lake, and we're out here to ask a really important question. How does coal form? You know, coal is that hard, black, compact rock that's formed from the woody tissue of ancient plants. Here we see a block of coal and we can see the layers, uh, very beautiful glassy layers inside of uh, the coal block. And in coal, we see these uh, glassy layers that are evidently sheets of bark that make uh, the dominant structure of coal. And we look at modern swamp deposits and we've been told that coal forms over long periods of time in big freshwater swamps. As the swamp condition prevails, the logs fall in from the forest and they get buried in the antiseptic waters of the swamp. And over long periods of time, a thick spongy layer of broken plant material called peat builds up. And this peat later gets buried by other sediment, such as clay and mud and sand. And the burial of this broken plant material is thought to have formed coal. But it takes thousands of years to form peat in swamps. Over great periods of time, it is imagined. And so a thick coal bed might be imagined to require hundreds of thousands of years to form. But can we see anything here at Spirit Lake that helps us understand the origin of coal? Mm -hmm.